Hello, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. My name is Christine and I like to read dark and disturbing things. I also like to get a lot of book boxes and book mail. Today I have the May Twisted Retreat Horror Book Box. So let's see what's inside. <laughs> confession time. You see, I've already opened this. I already did kind of take a quick peek inside because this came yesterday and I didn't have time to film, but I really wanted to take a peek. So I haven't really, really looked at everything, but I've peeked enough to be excited to think that this box is excellent. So this is the Twisted Retreat box. It is by the same people who do the Unplug book box and um, it's more horror related or dark reading related so if that's your thing this might be your book box so first of all i have my thing here and i'm gonna just look and see what the theme is because i didn't realize that this was on the card before so this says um it doesn't have a theme <laughs> so all right i'm gonna set this aside and try not to forget at the end to take a look at it um but this is what it looks like when I open it up and it is in a regular box I think because the goodies were too big to fit in their in their branded box and they did say that they're going to start ordering bigger branded boxes it doesn't really matter I mean a box is a box but um yeah just wanted to let you know and first thing I see on top California crispy blood orange slices I mean, I've seen these in drinks, but are you supposed to just eat them? I guess so, because they're dehydrated. Interesting. I've never had a dehydrated red blood orange, so I will try that. Next up, I'm going to open one of the items that I'm usually not super excited about, and that's the candle. I have an abundance of candles at this point, and I don't really melt candles very often um, because I melt wax. So I might have to put some in like a giveaway in the future. And these all have been the same type of thing. Let's see. No surface was safe. The world was her manuscript. Lowen Ashley. I don't know what that's from but there we go it has like the tarot design and I think I read somewhere that this might be the last box for a few months anyway that has a candle because it's going to get too hot and candles might melt it smells floral to me let me see if it tells us on our card here okay it says we choose Lowen from Colleen Hoover's Verity to represent this one that's funny. I've actually read that book. I think that's the only Colleen Hoover book I've read because everyone said it was so twisted and, and weird. And it was. It definitely was. But I already don't remember the name. It's interesting that they put a Colleen Hoover candle in the Twisted Retreat box. But but hey, I don't want to say anything bad about Hoover. There'll be some backlash, I'm sure. Next, I see... Let me, let me put the book... To the side for a sec. Next I see Twisted Retreat Natural Pure Honest Graveyard Dirt Coffee Scrub. Ooh, I love the smell of coffee. And so a coffee scrub sounds delightful. Ooh, it does kind of look like graveyard dirt, doesn't it? It doesn't smell super coffee y to me. But um, maybe once you use it, or maybe it's just that coffee grounds are used in the graveyard dirt. We got this cool hand reaching out. Okay, it says use this coffee scrub after digging graves and make sure to dig inside for a fun bonus item. Hint there's multiple designs. Which did you get? Oh, so there's, there's something in there apparently I got to dig it out so uh that'll be interesting to find kind of like a prize in a cereal box I like it next up this is really cool I I saw that I got this but I didn't open it to see exactly what it was and it is a shower curtain 
Um, I find this very cool, but I'm a little sad because I don't have any uh, shower curtain, any place to hang a shower curtain, basically. Um, my showers all have like those glass sliding doors. But let's see. I think it's a cool idea either way. And um, I would have loved this. Oh my God. I would have loved this when I did have it. So let's see if we could see. This looks like it is psycho themed. So we have someone in the shower. I might have to um, insert a clip so you could see the whole thing. Oh my God, this is so cool. I'll insert a clip so you could see the whole thing. This is really cool, but it's also something like if you had your, <laughs> I would love to put this in like a guest bathroom. So they're just like, what the heck is wrong with her? I mean, if they're staying at my house, they probably know, but I find that really cool. So that was the, um, and it even came with the rings that you need. So that's nice. Let's see here. American Psycho Shower Curtain. That was an awesome item. I almost want to like <laughs> be able to use a shower curtain, like take out the doors or something. I know that's stupid, but okay. Oh, next we have one of these diamond paintings. We got one of these once before and I started it. Did I finish it? No, I can't remember if it was in the unplug box or twisted retreat box now that I think about it. But, um, it's basically like this canvas and it comes with these little jewels that you kind of put on and it will make a picture in the end. And it is kind of like a great project to listen to books while you do because it doesn't take a whole lot of concentration. Um, so you could listen to your book and um, have something to do while you're doing this. So I'm going to try to open this to see if we can see what the picture is. So it comes with um, this little tray and the little stick and then these are all of the colored beads so you have to kind of have like a proper space to do this oh this is much smaller than the one i got and look at that the scream this is cool the other one i got was ginormous and very overwhelming and um i like the fact that this is a smaller canvas to work on i might actually finish this one um <laughs> I might actually start this one just to to finish one that's smaller and something that feels like I can actually complete this is very cool this is the scream diamond painting a classic painting by Edvard Munch that has been studied for its macabre and unsettling depiction of a person screaming this is an exclusive diamond painting from the twisted Team Twisted. This box is freaking amazing. I love it so far. So that is that. And I think we have one last item before the book. And this one, look, this is, I've been super excited for this. This is a little canvas bag. And the Nevermore. And this is a pocket up front. There is a zippered pocket in back. Handles here. I have gotten a lot of like book tote bags in, in these boxes, but this one is by far my favorite. I love, oh, there's a zipper pocket here. I love that this is like very subtle in the design. Like if you know what it is, you know what it is, but it's not like screaming, I'm a book nerd. Um, I love that this seems so Look at this huge pocket. It seems so well made. It's not um, feminine or masculine. It can go either way. And then it has like, like a messenger bag type um, strap that you can make longer. I think I will probably be using this as like my purse for work because it's the perfect size for a book and my wallet, my keys. I absolutely love this. It's just so well made. I've gotten a lot of them that are just kind of really cheaply made, but oh, and there's something inside. Hold on. Okay, we'll look at that in a sec. So inside, there's even zippered pockets. And this just doesn't feel cheap at all. 
this is probably one of the best items I've ever gotten out of a book box. Um, I love how useful it is. I love the attention to detail, the little faux leather uh, things here. I, I absolutely love this. This is so cute. I don't have a laptop and it might be a little small for a laptop depending on what you have, but I bet it would make a really good iPad bag. Um, I just really love it. This is like the perfect bag to me. Good job. Good job, Team Twisted. Let's see what it says, cause I, the Nevermore bag. Carry all your books around Nevermore Academy from the Wednesday series. Okay, I didn't realize that this was from, I knew it said Nevermore, but um, it is from that show Wednesday and they go to Nevermore Academy. Designed by Typical Ghost. You know what, Typical Ghost does a lot of their stuff and they always do an amazing job. This A++++, I love it. And then inside I found a little surprise. Oh my gosh. Oh, it has a little ghost on it. The darkness is where I shine. This looks like a little coin pouch. It has this adorable ghost design on the back has that stamped inside and a little snapped area. This is super cute. This might be perfect for um, just carrying like your essential cards with you as well. I love this. Again, another really useful, cute, practical item. I love it. What does it say about that? This spooky coin pouch features a cute ghost and a horror quote. It was designed by Typical Ghost. Go check out their um, Instagram. It's T-E-A-P-I-C-A-L dot ghost. All right. I'm ready for the book. I didn't even need a book in this box. This box blew me away. I absolutely loved it. This has got to be my favorite Twisted Retreat box that I've gotten so far. Everything has been perfect, but we still have a book called Sallow Bend by Alan Baxter. Ooh, it picks up better in the camera than I can see it in person. <laughs> so we have this creepy house and then like a reflection in the water, but then in the, in the reflection, you can see a girl. Let me open this up. Oh, you guys, this is cool. So the edges have the name of the title, but look at this. This looks like a merry-go-round. I love me some amusement park horror. Oh, I hope it, I hope it's amusement park horror. Whoa. This doesn't look very amusement parky, but look at that foiled. I love that. They have really been doing a good job with these um, exclusive editions here. All right, so it looks dark and creepy. Let's see what this book is about. Something old and deadly has awoken. When two teenagers go missing from a small rural town of Sallow Bend, the residents come together to search for them. Little do they suspect that finding the wayward girls will be the start of their problems. An old evil is rising, and only one man seems to realize that everyone in this danger Everyone is in danger, and this is not the first time it's happened. With the carnival in town, people want to have a good time. But for many, this will be the worst time of their lives. Carnival. Love it. This sounds like something I will really like. Um, I'm trying to read a lot of like carnival horror slash amusement park horror uh, this summer. I'm going to have to give this one a shot. I... This box, you guys, <laughs> I freaking loved it. This was by far my favorite box. We got a shower curtain. We got the diamond painting. We got our normal candle. We got our amazing messenger bag and our little coin pouch. Um, we got some graveyard dirt. We got a little snack, snacky snack. And then a very cool sounding book. Um, I 
yeah, I don't know what else to say. I love this box and this is by far my favorite Twisted Retreat box. Let me know down below what your favorite item was. Thank you so much for watching and as always, stay spooky.